Hello YouTubers, subscribers, and friends. I'm out here tinkering with my Camaro. And uh, went out and bought some wiper blades. Put the wiper blades on. Now, in case I'm driving in the rain, I can see. Put my back trim back on. I actually found the clips in the little bucket I have in the shed. But uh, yeah, this still needs to be reshaped because this isn't holding it down. My repair seems to be working. But uh, what I'm trying to tinker with today is door panels. I was going through the pile of stuff that the guy gave me when I bought this car. And the door panels are really shot. And I don't have all the door panels. So I'm trying to figure out... <sighs> this old ones here, They every time I shut the door throws this crap on my seats trying to figure out how to make door panels without having to spend a lot of money um, it's really really muggy out here today close to rain and uh, I don't even think these are the right ones to be honest because it doesn't seem to line up right and this uh, this has nothing to screw to so I don't know what door panels he got these out of, but I'm missing the whole center part there. And I need to work on the door panels and uh, figure out how to make door panels with that all over my seat again. Without spending a lot of money on door panels if I don't have to. So I came up with this idea. Here's what I have on the left side. Another one that doesn't really go with it. Came up with this idea to try to make a mold out of cardboard. It's just a test. I kind of like soaked it with water, make it so it's more pliable. And then I bent it into shape. And it goes down and goes underneath and folds under underneath this. Like I said, they, I don't think these are the original door panels because nothing lines up. There's no screw holes lining up with anything. But uh, I was thinking about, you know, making a, a mold out of uh, cardboard and then covering this cardboard with uh, like a paper mache or something. I've been watching a lot of videos on paper mache and it ends up when it dries it's like really really hard and then after uh, getting it made out of paper mache uh, give it a coating of some kind of hard spray hardener or something and then cover it with material but this is what I've been working on today you see it bends and goes down in there I can roll the window down and window goes up if I can just push it down because this is still flexible if this was harder it would, would not roll up with the window and then I would have to put some kind of felt strip on the inside of this so it would slide instead of pushing up on what it's doing I mean I see everybody making uh, door panels out of fiberglass and stuff and I've done it before in VW's that I've owned but uh I was just trying to think outside the box and do something different. And I tried to see if anybody else on YouTube was making it out of cardboard because I've seen so many things made out of cardboard, Iron Man suits, boxes, dragons, tables, chairs, all out of cardboard. And they've sprayed a, a coating over the cardboard which makes the cardboard stiffen up because it absorbs that spray. And once it dries it's really hard like fiberglass. And it seems really easy to do. If I want to make a chair or a couch or a box or a dragon, you know, I know how to do it out of cardboard. Just I haven't seen anybody make a door panel out of cardboard or a uh, paper mache. You know, get the mold made out of cardboard and then paper mache over the cardboard, and then when that hardens, um, put a coating over that paper mache and then cover it with material. That's that's what I was thinking of trying to do. But I couldn't find a video, so that's why I'm making this video. 
it's pretty hard because underneath there is, is one of these uh, window felt molding holder things. You get one, two, there's three on this one. And uh, that's what supports this. But I was thinking a after this is done, you could put some kind of uh, spray foam underneath it to make it fill in this, to make it even harder. But, uh, so I'm just thinking out loud, making a video here. If that's a good idea or not. This was fairly easy to do. I did this in five minutes. It was so easy. You know, sticking it down in there, spraying it with water, and then bending it into the shape of one, and then taping this to dry. And it dries really fast out here in the Arizona heat. But I don't know. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to keep researching on how to make door panels. I've seen them made out of wood and fiberglass. Like I said, I'm just trying to do outside of thinking, thinking outside the box and do something different. But for now, that's it. I'm calling it a day because it's too hot for me. I'm gonna go!